guys, welcome back to In Case of Econ Struggles. Got a quick Sunday data tip for you involving regressions, so let's get into it. Basically, suppose you're asked on an assignment, you're asked to run these regressions, and you're also asked to find the predicted values or the fitted values and the residual or the error term in the regression. This is how you do it. So I've got a regression right here with the auto data. It's gonna be price on a bunch of different variables. So I'll go ahead and run that, and I've got my nice regression table here. Now, when you run a regression, Stata can also predict the fitted values just like this. So we're gonna say predict and then a variable name, I'm gonna call it x hat. x hat is going to be the option xb, which is just the variables times the coefficients, which is gonna be the fitted value. And then if I want the residual or the error term in the regression, I'm gonna predict another variable, and I'm gonna use this residual or resid option. So we'll go ahead and run that. And you can see that now what I've got is I've got an x hat and an e. We know that in a regression, y should be x times b plus e. So we can check that. We can generate a regression sum, which is just x hat plus a residual. Then I'm just gonna order it, just so when I browse, it's gonna be a little easier to read. Order a command, super helpful just for reordering variables. And then I'm gonna go ahead and browse. I'm gonna browse these specific variables. If we did this correctly, it should be the case that our price, or our actual price y, is equal to x hat plus e and we can see that it is, so we must have done this correctly. So if this video or these videos in general helping you out, please like and subscribe. We'll see you next time for another case of Econ Struggles.